Hi there. Now the answer for part A is 729 and the answer for part B is 16x. So I'll just take you through these basic results on indices. If you're unsure of any work on indices, do check out my video tutorials on my website. So we've got 81 to the power 3 over 2. The 2 here, remember, represents the nth root of whatever you've got. In this case, it's the square root of 81. And then the 3 on the top means we cube it. So square root of 81 then is 9. When you cube it, 9 times 9 times 9 is 729. Now for this one here, x squared times 4x to the minus half all squared. I've got the x squared at the front here, but then this power here operates over both of these values here. Over the 4, that's going to be 4 squared, okay? And then x to the minus a half, that 2 is squared. So 4 squared is 16, then I've got the x squared, and this rule here is just simply multiply the 2 with the power. 2 times minus a half is minus 1. And then Add the powers here when you're multiplying, and that gives us x to the power 1, or just simply x. So you get 16x. An alternative at this stage here for x to the minus 1 is to think of this as 1 over x. And then you can cancel, okay? And that just brings you back to 16x.